Fellow viewers, welcome once again to Smart Agro Innovation, your channel that teaches much about agriculture, smart ideas that can be performed at the comfort of your own farms. Today, my attention is on the fact that we started um, some episode earlier concerning the how to produce 500 sackets from one sacker. We are still monitoring closely and I tell you um, we are on the 28 days uh, results. It has been an amazing journey when we started that movement and I believe that through your support, through your kind opinions and ideas and comments keep us going. Therefore, I say thank you very much to our subscribers. If today is the first day of watching us, please kindly subscribe to our channel, share and like to promote the good works of Smart Agro Innovations. Now, when we started the whole procedure, it has been labeled in episodes. So you move, you log on, you subscribe, go to Smart Agro Innovation, you'll see that when it comes to plantage to banana sucker multiplication, it's a global movement because it has taken the root to the whole world and everybody sees the good work that we have been doing. We do, we perform the work, the research work, and we give back the results to our subscribers. A lot of our subscribers are doing well with our massive um, ideas in the field of agriculture. Uh, this is our training room, this is our lecture room, and this is also our office and our studio all in one therefore um let's go to the third and watch the progress of how to put 500 circuits from one sucker let's go and watch into smart agro innovation your channel that gives simple but smart ideas in the field of agriculture especially when it comes to plantains and bananas today we are still on uh Post nursery where we are still multiplying the circus using my simple method at the post nursery. The whole process that involved this experiment is already do let's go and watch the little flashback and the successive um, results that we've had. Today they are this particular experiment is 28 days old. We are still monitoring. On the 21st day, we came and detached some of the seedlings. So, in order to pave way for the parent to continue with its cell division process. In fact, um, there had been a result. There had been some results. After removal, after detachment of some of the seedlings, where we have the records there, Still, they are sprouting. I told you a week ago, um, we detached some seedling from this side, yet there are some sproutings here coming up. You had a lot, you know, all these are ready for detachment. In fact, I will still detach it. We detached some from here, um, a week ago, and still you can see that they are sprouting. One thing is that one, especially with this one. It gave only one. Once we remove this, then the parent pseudo stem will also get the strength to still continue with its cell division process. But if this one is still there, it doesn't have the capability because this is strong. It is dependent on extracting all its nutrients from the parent because this one doesn't have root at the moment, just that it is born in the pseudo stem. So we are going to remove it as we did two days a week ago and you can see the result that after detachment of the seedling, the mature seedling, yet there are smaller ones coming up. So you can watch this closely. We are going to detach it and after detachment you will see that by next week there will still be other sproutings coming up. Yeah. So after the whole thing, we want you to watch after this we, we will all remove all the ones which are gone last week we still detached some from here and you can see that 
there had been some seedlings coming up all these places we did some detachments this is matured we are coming to detach it yeah so we are detaching almost all the ones that give good seedlings here it has given we removed some from here last week yet we have extra three so now this one alone has been able to give us we remove about two from here so it means that we've had six so far yeah we are monitoring closely this one is also still coming up as you can see these ones are also up there and i tell you this process of multiplication is very simple and straightforward these ones are also coming up you can see that this portion we remove some yet we are still sprouting you can see one is here one is here one is here so now it means that we are getting more numbers yeah we are getting more numbers all these portions are here 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 this one has been one two three I'm still counting now there is one thing that we saw during this uh, uh, multiplication process this was there already it is not from this parent you realize that this one um uh, still it is growing but there is one thing here this one yeah it is still coming up we've had one two three And still counting. This is the pseudo stem. Four, there's another coming up. But here, if you can see, you can look at it clearly. You realize that the parent is still trying to come up. The epica Mary stem here was not totally destroyed. And for that reason, the parent is still coming back to eat normal life so is here when that happens it affects sprouting it means that we did not during the um, killing of the eye or the division of the eye the process didn't go well so as a matter of fact the epical system still has to regenerate germinate and after germination you can see that it is coming up so the total number of seedlings expected will be affected yeah but since it has germinated uh we can't do anything about it you will not care that i will leave it to grow after everything that we detail the whole thing fortunately for us at least we have two coming up but after these two there's no way we'll get other ones because the epical marriage stem couldn't spread throughout the divisions and that affected this particular pseudo stem let's see there's another one here let's go and check that one too Awesome. Mm -hmm. There is another one here. Now, you can see the way this one is sprouting. That it has one, two, three, four. But let's look at this. You see that during the killing of the eye the process was not well performed as a matter of fact the epical meristem has to regenerate and now it is growing as one we needed more but unfortunately the process didn't go deep and the epical meristem was not destroyed so it is still coming up we will not destroy it we will leave it and after it has fully grown then we perform another experiment on it so this is the uh result after 28 days we are still monitoring and keeping records on the total number that we will get from one so that at the end of the day we conclude this is smart agro innovation once again your channel that teaches smart about agriculture our doors are open for trainings and business opportunities our contacts are still on the screen at the end of the video you can see our contact the beginning of the video our contacts are there my name is Antony Beidou and I'm presenting from Ghana West Africa